Uh oh. Bad cigarette lighter. This, that's not very old either. It is corrode. So check this out. We have no lock up, right? I did this yesterday in the other car. Alright, gotta go to 94. Light truck. Power train. Goes by engine code LO3. Automatic. We don't need. Is it special functions? Transmission. I'll put controls. Alright, so let's go. You hear it? You hear it? Okay, here it. TC solenoid. I don't know, I don't kind of hear it. It says it's going on though. The one on the other card is loud as hell, which is strange. I don't know. I wonder if that's an issue with that that's not working at all. Let's try it over here. I don't really hear it. This is strange. This is it's working though. I, don't know, I have another solenoid. I know they gave me a few shit ones. See it? Everything else you hear an audible click. I hear that too. Watch a plane will fly over here in a minute. Yep. The torque converter is so annoyed. And they're not here. It says it's on too. But you don't hear it. Every other car you do that test. Ouch. It's loud as hell. It's literally loud as hell. Yeah. I guess you change the solenoid. Watch, you'll try something else. You hear it under here. Like, now it's off. Hear nothing. Every other car is super freaking loud. That I've done this on. I could do the one two solenoid, you'll hear it. Hear it? That's what the torque converter solenoid should make the same sound. Go back to torque converter solenoid. Cause this is so old it won't even um look on. Off. On. Off. 
Don't hear it. I don't know. On to something, drop that pan. Maybe we'll get lockup back. Because it works when it wants to, which is strange. So electrical, my feet. Feet spring into a transmission shop. We could ride around too and cycle that. Lost the communication. Yeah. Chinese tech too, everybody. Chinese tech too. I gotta clean that thing, it's rusty again. Broke that thing once, the whole assembly that's new. It was all cracked and everything. Cold water just split on me. Hopefully it doesn't break again. I remember I said that, that mirror is too high. Is it needs to go down lower? They messed up. Uh, test bench car, the car that um, someone said I should be a floor sweeper in their shop. Hear that pump? That pump is done, I just remembered that. Heard that yesterday. So, we'll do it on floor sweeper car. Just get that scrambled miles. Yeah, I had a 96 cluster for this, sold it. I had a Z28 cluster, sold it. Now I have a broken cluster. I don't know what that is, scrambles like that. Like low voltage deal, that you drive it, it stops. This is very annoying. You know what did that shit, the messed up roads? Messed up road to crack something in the north country. Uh, what are you, diagnostics. Floor sweeper car. A kid, uh, some moron knows everything, I guess. On the internet, has no videos. Saying that nobody junks these cars when the windows and the AC and Opti Spark breaks. Saying nobody in the world does that. Are you ignorant? Yes, you are. Um, when we get that elastic, fields, special functions, transmission output controls, now shh, shh, transmission solenoid, shh, watch the same solenoids in the white truck, watch, hear it? You hear it on the white truck though? You didn't hear it on the white truck. This didn't have control, a little different though. This has PWM. It has PWN. Can I? No. Inactive. Break switch. Oh, we didn't check that on the We didn't check that on the uh, white truck either. Brake switch has a, uh, whatever. It's not like my brakes are stuck on or anything, and that could be a probability. My brake switch is not stuck on. Kick down the new one. All right, exit. So you do hear that. So that's my getaway of saying something is wrong. With that solenoid. Or the harness or something. But the computer commands it on, but nothing happens in the pan. Could be a cheap solenoid. Could be a solenoid chunked up with stuff. See the shift solenoids? Again, watch. Watch how loud it is. Shush. Alright. I have all... See this asshole locally, they should have left all my stock parts in there. Work fine. This to wreck up the bill and put all this aftermarket garbage in here, and you know what new parts are the garbage made in China. So they should have left the OEM parts that work just fine, but they uh, they thought that um, you know we could just do. So I can't do this on the uh, white truck. Doesn't not enabled. That was like second year of 4068. This was like third year. And then 96 to change it again, and then it went to a two piece, and they had a input sensor in the front, like 97, 98 or something. A lot of changes were made. It's like one year only stuff for a couple of years. Yeah, so I'm thinking possibly that solenoid is messed up. One of the things that starts. Still starts. 
battery doesn't sound so hot. How much gas? We still got a quarter tank. Still starts though. Well, I haven't started this thing in a very long time. I should turn that off in case something is on. Is on in there. Well, exit. What we gotta do? We gotta go to all this shit again. I should really check that. I seriously might have something that's contacting something. To, what am I doing? Diagnostics? I'm like lost here. Thinking about too much stuff. Fire pack my car. Oh, this thing stinks. Still smells like shit. It's a cold day today. What is it? 675 in here. A little colder outside. This thing stinks. Hmm. 0.64, it's a little higher in the TPS, we gotta adjust that. The wagons is high too. Long term, 160? Really? It's like, kind of lean as hell, 160? Yeah, lean as hell. Isn't that, yeah. That's like max. Well, now it's changing. Oh, I know why. I think they did that with the tune. This thing's all fucked up. See, it goes in uh, open loop really fast, or closed loop. Well, now it stabilizes faster. Around 128. Anyway. Hey, we. Oh, we should always put this. In case you go through the wall in your house. Is this gonna break anything? Should we try it? How's that tapping sound? You hear that? It sounds like it got an exhaust leak. The engine's blowing up. Alright. Should we enable the torque converter solenoid at idle? Does nothing. Does nothing. No change. Just broke it. Alright. Don't play. Yep. Oh, I should have powered it off first. Got a breaker Chinese tech 2. Yeah, but that's strange though. I think we might have a solenoid issue. And this thing I gotta change the pump on because it's low. Low, low, low. Yeah. Look at that shit. Paint comes off every time we get hot. Peels right off. Paint. I put a. Uh, did I go right up to the edge? No, I didn't. I messed up. I gotta redo that. I put. Um, Clear stuff over there so it stops sticking somewhat. And it glues itself to the rubber. It's a design flaw. I like these whole cars were a design flaw. Some people don't think that though. I think everything's fine and dandy. Fine and dandy. So, keys. Oh, that's why that's burning, right? Shit over there. It's blowing exhaust, can't even come out. Yeah, we got nothing over there. We gotta fix this thing though. At least it still runs. It's commanding on. Doesn't mean this is moving. And this thing is loud. I bench tested this thing. It is as loud as what you heard in the other car. You hear that? Should be hearing that in white truck. Don't hear it. They put poly locks same way, so these poly locks could be loose on mine. 
or it's just garbage. The uh, new Chinese ones, they don't even have this grommet over here. So the wires eventually can just short out on the actual frame of these things. I don't even know how these work. Anyone know how these work? You get a seal, you get a ball in there, and is that where fluid comes through? Here and there. And then, is there fluid flow through there, and then that just allows it to pass through this hole and up through there? I'm not sure. I'm surprised there's no seal around it. I don't know. If you know, 700R4, I think they started that. Maybe even uh, TH400 or 350. I'm not sure if they had lock up converter. But, yeah. I don't know. Does fluid go through those two holes? I'm not sure about that. If you know, let me know. I'm pretty sure that shit is bad though. It's just two bolts. I have no PWM, so nothing's blocking it. And then they, uh, valve body so it's pretty much drop the pan two tens hook up your wires you're done then I gotta slide back the cross member ugh pain in the ass